Hey guys, what is going on? Stingray Von Gray here, bringing you a Black Ops 3 video here today. And today, guys, have some gameplay on the map hunted using the VMP. And yeah, I actually uh, got this gameplay two days ago, I believe. Um, I was gonna upload it, but I I tried uploading Infinite Warfare video. I'm sure most of you saw it. It was it was supposed to be a fun video about you know just like a rage or whatever. And it, it didn't really go over so well, like, just, I don't know, man, like, people just weren't, I don't know if they just didn't like the video, if I just did a, I mean, I didn't really do a commentary, it's just, you know, basically my friend complaining the whole time, and I didn't really commentate on it, and it, it just didn't really get the response I was more or less looking for, um, I, I, like I said, I don't know if the video was just poor, which yeah, I really didn't put any, I'm gonna be honest, no effort into it. It was just supposed to be a thing, a funny video, you know, just whatever, Infinite Warfare. And I don't know if people just hate Infinite Warfare that much, where there's like, no support for it, or what it is, man. Like, I'm actually like, really confused, and, and like, as a Call of Duty fan myself, it, it's, it's really like, it's a bummer, man. Like. I want this game to go over well, and I want to be able to enjoy it, you know what I'm saying, like, no matter what game it is, I mean, people have their opinions, and, and they've definitely showed it for, you know, years, as far as Call of Duty games are concerned, you know, and there's always been a really big difference in opinion, you know, and that that's what makes the Call of Duty community so strong, and just such an awesome community to be around, is, you know, the difference of opinions, everything, you know, uh, feedback, and that's what keeps my YouTube channel going, is, is feedback, you know, I try to post gameplay that you guys like, and I try to shy away from things you guys don't like, and when I make a mistake, I admit it, and I try to move on from it, that's just how, you know, a YouTube channel should work, and I don't want to sit here and, and make garbage videos for you guys, you know, I want you guys to enjoy everything I put out, naturally, and you know, I'm sure you guys want the same. You want to enjoy what I put out. You know, you just don't want to be, you know, throwing up some, like, you know, lazy ass video and, you know, just think that I just don't care about you guys or I'm not putting effort into it. Um, which wasn't isn't the case. Like I said, I just, you know, thought I could put a funny video up there and you guys would enjoy it. Um, but like I said, the feedback was not too well on it. Um, just didn't receive the support I thought it might. But it's okay. I mean, that's that's the whole point. You know, you live and you learn. And you know, I'm just I'm just not sure if I want to put any more Infinite Warfare gameplays up for you guys. I mean, it, it really all depends on what you want. I know some people said they wanted to see a, a stats video on me. Um, some people wanted to see me reset my stats. Um, you know, there's a, there's a lot of different things that you guys wanted to see, and I could do that. It, it really doesn't matter to me. Like I said, at this point. You know, I'm level 1000, I've done everything in the game, you know, I've got Dark Matter, so it, it doesn't matter to me. But, you know, I, I just, I don't, I don't know if you guys have ever actually, like, if you've played the game or not, or if you, you just seen, like, the trailer. Because I'm gonna be honest with you, and I'm gonna be as real as I can with you guys right now, the trailer for Infinite Warfare was absolute garbage. Like, it was, it was so bad that I didn't want to play the game. But once I... Once I learned that the game was not that bad, um, once I played it and gave it a chance, um, I learned that it really wasn't that bad of a game, and it, it's enjoyable to me. Like I really have a fun time with it, and I'm not trying to sound like you know a team art or whatever. I, I I'm being real with you guys. Like I I genuinely enjoy the game. Like it's really not that bad of a game, and it takes a while to get into. It, I'm gonna be honest. Like. You know, it doesn't move like Black Ops 3 does. Black Ops 3 has great movement system. Um, everything just feels nice, man. Like, the guns in Black Ops 3 are so nasty. Like, there's nothing like a good VMP, you know, quad feed. But, um, you know, I, I, I'm starting to fall in love with Infinite Warfare. And it's the first Infinity War game I've personally liked since MW3. And... You know, that, that's saying a lot, because that means, you know, there, there was a, you know, there's ghosts. I, and, you know, I just didn't like ghosts. Like, this, this game to me is probably, you know, 
a second, a backseat to MW3, you know. But uh, it's just, it, it, it's, it's what we're going to get for now, and, you know, it's just, it is what it is, you know. It, it was a lot better than Advanced Warfare, I can tell you that. I mean, the movement system is really the same. Um, some of the guns feel really, really nice, man. Um, but, I mean, but there's a few things I absolutely hate about the game. You know, in, in like, in my opinion, I think Black Ops 3 was an absolute masterpiece. There are some things I didn't agree with, um, as far as, like, nerfs go. Like, that's just a, that's a video for a whole nother day, man. But as far as a game... This thing was an absolute masterpiece, no matter what anybody says. I think this game was absolutely awesome. But that's just me. Um, I mean, like I said, you guys are going to have to form your own opinion. I'm not telling you how to think, I'm just telling you how I feel. This is, you know, the realest I'm ever going to be. You know, or, or uh, the realest I'm, I always am with you guys, I should say. You know, I don't ever feed you a line, I'm going to tell you exactly how I feel. But yeah, it's just, it's really, it's really growing on me, guys. Like, I just finally got a nuke variant, which is kind of annoying that you have to do that. But I finally got my first nuke variant, so now I can start going for, like, nuclears and, um, you know, I got the VSAT unlocked or whatever they're calling it nowadays. So I can start, you know, having an easier time going for the VSAT, you know, it's just, it's, it's a growing process right now, and, you know, once once you get everything that you need unlocked, it's, it's really a smooth game. Um, all I'm saying in this video, and all I'm trying to get across, my whole point being is just, if, if you hate the game, I get it, like, you know, there's a lot of people that don't like it. But it, if you never played it and you're telling me you hate it, you gotta give it a chance, because if you like Black Ops 3, you're gonna really like, um, Infinite Warfare, because it plays the same, the mechanics are the same, um, you know, just a few complaints are like the specialists are overpowered, like 129% overpowered, but other than that, I mean, the game itself plays absolutely amazing, and some of the guns are really, really nice, and I think you guys would actually really enjoy it if you gave it a chance, but uh, hopefully I'll be able to come up with more uh, Black Ops 3 videos for you guys, or Infinite Warfare. Depending on what you guys want to see, but um, hope you guys did enjoy the gameplay today, and a little rant, sorry for that, but uh, I needed to get that off my chest, you guys, I needed you guys to know how I felt about that, so, um, hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day, um, leave a like, and uh, I'm sure the comments are going to explode on this video, um, and subscribe if you're new for uh, more Call of Duty gameplay. Have a nice day, guys, catch you in the next one, later.